Hello everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome back to one of the most exciting videos of the year. It is my annual autumn decor haul. So in this video, if you're new here, I show you everything that I have for autumn. It's sort of like a big collective haul and it's things I've picked up over the past few years. So I am currently looking at a floor full of autumn stuff. It makes me so happy to see all of my autumn collection out because you know what's really nice about collecting stuff is every single year I forget what I have and when we empty the cupboard of all of the autumn stuff and I lay it out in front of me I'm like oh my god I love that and it's something that I've bought maybe like two years ago. So in this haul there are some old things that you may have seen before but there are also some new items and obviously if you are new here you won't have seen any of this stuff before so I'm very excited for you guys to see it. Thank you so much for clicking on today's video. Make sure you've got an autumn candle burning. This one here is honey pumpkin and if you have not smelt it from home sense it's the dw home candle it's my favorite autumn candle and it makes the room just smell so autumnal and cozy and it's just one of the best candles i highly recommend it so that's obviously the first thing in this haul today is my honey pumpkin candle and make sure you've got a nice drink again this is a newbie for this year this is my new mug that callum actually got me in a boo basket i have got some things to show you if you haven't already seen it but this is such a beautiful mug and it's from next it's got all of these different colored pumpkins on it and it's like speckled and it's just beautiful and you know what i love the shape of it I don't know what it is about drinking a cup of tea out of a mug that is just like the perfect shape and I can't explain it really. Only tea drinkers will know what I mean about having like the perfectly shaped mug and it makes the tea so much nicer to drink from and it's all like glossy and it feels nice on your lips. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if that sounds weird but I absolutely love this one and as I said it's from Next. So get a nice hot drink, we're going to get into this video, it may be a very long one guys, I've got so much to show you, I don't know if I'm going to be able to show all of it because this video could be about two hours long, but I'm going to show you like my favourite items from my autumn decor collection, so let's go. I actually have no idea where to start, I think I'm going to start with the pumpkins because I have a lot of pumpkins. And they're all really reasonably priced as well. If I can remember where they're from, I'll definitely let you know. And I probably won't be able to remember the price because, as I said, this collection has been growing for about three years. Maybe four, actually. But the first pumpkin that I have is actually new this year. I can remember the price of this. I think this was $8.99 or $9.99 from the range. And it's just a pillow. So I thought I could put this on the bed. It's so squishy. Um, it's this Borg fabric. It's got a really beautiful chocolate stalk. And I am obsessed with this. I'm definitely going to be putting this on my bed to decorate with. I have actually got some bedding that I can't show you because I've put it on the bed. But if I remember, I'm going to insert a clip now. This is a note to editing Sophie. Insert the clip of the bed. We got some really beautiful pumpkin bedding. It's got like acorns. It's got leaves. It's got like pumpkins with smiley faces. It's just really cute. And I put it on yesterday and it just looks adorable. So this is going to go really nicely on there. I then got two more pumpkins that are actually door stops. So they're quite heavy. So this is the cream one and it's got like this really long wicker stalk. No, it's not wicker. Twine. Twine stalk. So I've got the cream and I also got the red one as well. I think these were from last year or the year before from the range, but they were really reasonably priced. I think they're around like five pounds. And I absolutely love these. I have actually seen them in store this year, but I think they're a little bit smaller this year. These are actually massive compared to those ones, but I love them. I then got two of these really adorable woven pumpkins. These were from B&M last year, I believe, and I love decorating with these. I like that they've got sort of sticks for stalks and I love the leaves on top as well. They're just perfect. They are perfect. In my home, if you guys are new, I like to decorate with sort of neutrals, but also with orange. I love, I love decorating with orange. I don't know what it is. It just makes me feel so happy. And I know a lot of the beige autumn is becoming very big nowadays, but I just still love to stick to all of the traditional autumn colors. So like burgundies, 
orange, browns, reds. I just, I love, I love that kind of autumn. That is my favourite autumn. I then got some wicker pumpkins. These came in a set last year from the range. I get so many of my autumn things from the range. The range is just the best for autumn. But I love these. So you've got a brown one, an orange one, and a cream one. And these looked perfect on my windowsill last year. I don't really know how I'm gonna decorate, but we are decorating today, by the way, guys. Decorate with me for autumn video is coming very, very soon. So straight after this video, we are going full blown autumn in this household. But yeah, these were on the windowsill last year and I really, really love them. And I think they were really inexpensive. And I think they're in store this year as well. I then got this beautiful glass pumpkin. I remember when these were like the craze one autumn, everyone was trying to get their hands on a glass pumpkin. I got mine from HomeSense and I've also filled it up with pine cones and also some fairy lights as well, but I do need to change the batteries in the fairy lights. But this looks so cute when it's turned on and especially at night, it just looks beautiful. Really good quality, it's lasted me like four years. I'm surprised I haven't managed to break it yet. Touch wood, wherever there is some wood. But these look beautiful in any room and I highly recommend filling yours with pine cones and some fairy lights. And I do have many, many more pumpkins but these are the last two pumpkin things that I'll show you and they are some ramekins from Next. These came in a set when I bought them, but I think they sell them separately now, which I think is very cheeky next. But I really love these. I use them for decorative normally, but I think I actually might, I think I say this every year, I might use them for baking, but usually they just sit on the side of my kitchen for decor. But you've got this really nice orange one, and it's sort of like a brownie orange. And then you've got a cream one and I love the gold stalks as well. They are very well made, very good quality. Nice size as well if you want to make like a mini, I don't know, pie or like a crumble or something. They'd be really cute. Moving on to tea towels, speaking of kitchen, because I have some really beautiful ones. Now these, if you watch me often and you've been watching my autumn content for a few years, you will have probably seen these every single year. They are my favorite autumn tea towels and I don't know how these haven't got ruined yet, but I'm not mad about it. I'm really happy that they've survived the past few years. There is a little bit of discoloration, but that's bound to happen when they're old tea towels. But yeah, I really, really love these and I got these from HomeSense a few years ago. And then I also picked up some new ones this year. So these are from the range and they've got some really lovely pumpkins all over them, different colours. Um, there's like a brown one and an orange. And then you also get a sage green one and then you get a white and green one as well. I thought that this was good and practical because even when it's not autumn, I can use the last two tea towels as well but I really like the pumpkin one, obviously. And these were really inexpensive and they were from this year. Now for cushions. I have quite a few cushions. Being the first one, so it says autumn wishes and cozy kisses. This is from the range last year, or it might be the year before, but I absolutely love this one. I think I put this on the bed last year, so I might do that this year because the bedding that we have has got orange in it, so it will go really nicely with the words. I also then have this one, which is one of my favorites, and it says, hey pumpkin, it's a Borg material, and this was from the range as well. I think again, this was a couple of years ago, and this usually goes on the sofa. And then I also have this one, which is a little bit more neutral, and it says, leaves are falling, autumn is calling. I think this was from last year, but again, this was from the range, and I absolutely love it. I just love having like seasonal cushions. It's just, there's something about it that makes me so happy. Now for blankets, we have this one here, which is so nice. It's one of my favorites. It's lasted me like four years. I think I got this in our first ever home and I got this from HomeSense. It's got really beautiful like autumn vegetables on there, like pumpkins. I think there's a squash or a pear or something. It's got nice green leaves and it's so soft and it's really, really big. I always find that Home Sense is great for autumn blankets. I then have this one, which has lots of autumn leaves all over it. It's quite a thinner material than the other one, but it's still really soft and very comfortable to sit under. This one was from the range last year or the year before. And it's just still so soft. 
and they've been in the wash multiple times and they're still so comfortable and then callum also got me another one this year which is this one it was in my boo basket and it's got lots of autumn seasonal things all over it so you've got leaves pumpkins um some kind of squash acorns toadstools there's loads of stuff on here and again it's really soft and very very comfortable and this was from matalan this year we've then got some like plaques signage that sort of stuff so i've got this one which i put in the kitchen last year and it's from timu and it just says the old fall market hay rides corn maze bonfires apple cider pumpkins this way it's very american style it's very farmhousey which is the kind of vibe that i love my absolute dream guys is just to live in a cottage i <laughs> just i love that sort of vibe and i really really like this and it was really reasonably priced i literally think it's like a couple of pounds if you haven't already definitely go on to timu and have a look at their autumn stuff because they do have some beautiful things um, then I also got this one, which is from the range, and it says pumpkin spice latte, two shots espresso, 250 milk. It's basically the recipe for a pumpkin spice latte. But I love the diagrams on this. It's very cosy. I thought it would look really nice in front of a chopping board in the kitchen. And it's just a very nice decorative piece. And it was like £2.99 from the range this year. You literally can't go wrong. I think they had another version of this as well maybe like a pie recipe or something i can't remember but i really liked the pumpkin spice latte one and then finally another thing that was in my boo basket is this sign that says hello pumpkin callum got this from home bargains i think he said and it's so cute it's got all these little pumpkins i love the colors in it it's very very autumnal and i just there's just something about this that just makes me feel really cozy i can't ever imagine just having like beige autumn i just have to have stuff like this a couple of candles that i've got as well so obviously i've got that one there honey pumpkin but i also picked up this one this year which is called cozy cottage i actually this is a repurchase because i loved the smell of it so much and i burnt the first one so quickly so i got this one and it was 6.99 from home sense cozy cottage you have to smell it it is it just smells like a cozy cottage and then this one is from last year which i still have loads left of and it's the pumpkin spice one i never chuck away my candles if i have a seasonal candle that i don't get the whole way through and there's like a decent amount left i will always save it for the next year so this is a really really nice one i love the pumpkins on the side as well it was just too pretty to throw away and i do think they have very similar in home sense this year i also have a pumpkin oven glove which callum put in my well it was supposed to be in my boo basket but he forgot that he'd ordered it and it actually arrived after he'd given me it so this i don't think any of you guys have seen this yet but this is what it looks like it's got very cute neutral pumpkins all over it i think this was from matalan he said and we actually don't have an oven glove at the moment so this was perfect we really needed one and it is so beautiful now for my wreaths everyone so the first wreath is this one here and i got this from timu last year and i put this in the kitchen so i'm not really sure where i'm going to put this this year but i really like all of the colors i love the pumpkins it's just like obviously faux plants but i really really love this one and then we have my trusty ebay purchase from 2021 maybe that has lasted me all this time and it cost me a bargain price of like 14 pounds and look at the colors if this doesn't make you feel autumnal i don't know what will i love it and it's got all like sparkles on the pumpkins it's just my favorite it's my favorite we then have this beautiful garland and i think this was from the range and it actually lights up it's got little twinkly lights all over it and it's really long and i put this on the tv unit last year and i think i'm going to do that this year as well i love this i can't express to you what a bargain this was i think it was 15 pounds and i'm obsessed with it i'm obsessed with the colors the berries it's just beautiful the leaves and then there's the pack there for the batteries it's stunning and then i also have these leave lights I can't express to you how much I love these. They light up. I don't know where the uh, back bit of the battery pack is though. But I'm going to have to untangle these. They are so long. I put these around the banister last year. But we don't actually have a banister 
on the stairs this year we do but you can't wrap stuff around it so i don't really know what i'm gonna do i'll definitely find a place for them though because they are beautiful maybe around the bed that would look cute then for the coffee table i bought a new vase which is this really lovely brown color and it's like see-through glass and then i got this faux plant well it's not a plant they're actually the little i don't know what you would call these they're faux eucalyptus and they came in different colours. I think it came in a set. So you've got orange, purple, and like this green sort of one that's about to turn basically. But I really think that this is so autumnal and cosy and I can't wait to put this on the coffee table. And both of these were from Dunelm. We've then got some potpourri. So this one was in my boo basket and it's from Next. And it is in the shape of a pumpkin and it's pumpkin and maple scented potpourri. And it smells so nice it's really like autumnal and cozy i feel like i'm gonna say that for everything but we also have this one here which is in the shape of little pumpkins and this was from the range this year and it's pumpkin potpourri i think it just smells like pumpkin spice oh it smells like cinnamony it's very very nice another thing from the boo basket a little soap dispenser this is really sweet. It's got a gold lid and it's also got little gold pumpkins all around it. That's going to go in the downstairs bathroom. Oh, and I've got this cute little coaster, which I've had for a few years now. My friend Sophie actually got me for my birthday one year two coasters and she got them from Etsy. The other one's actually on my dressing, like my dresser in the bedroom. But I really love this one as well. It's got pumpkins all over it and the other one has like leaves, autumn leaves all over it. But how sweet is this. I love to put this on the coffee table. We've got some autumn doormats. So this is the first one. This is in the shape of a pumpkin. It says Hello Pumpkin on it. I can't actually remember where this was from. I feel like it was Matalan or maybe the range. And then another one that was in my boo basket was this one that says Hello Autumn and it's from Matalan. This is really sweet. I think I'm going to put this one on the back door and then the pumpkin one on the front door. We also got some coasters, some pumpkin wicker coasters, which are so sweet. These were eight pounds from Dunelm and I am obsessed with them. And then I've also got some pumpkin wax melts as well from the range. They smell really, really good. And then we've also got this basket, which is what my boo basket came in. And I'm going to use it for throws in the living room. And it just says hello autumn on it. This was from Home Bargains. And it is really, really sweet. So guys, I think that is all I'm going to show you for today because I feel like this video is very, very long. I really hope you've enjoyed seeing my favourite items from my home decor collection for autumn. Don't forget to give this video a like if you did enjoy it. Also subscribe if you're new. There's lots of awesome content coming your way. I really hope you guys have an amazing rest of your weekend. And I will see you in the next video on Wednesday for a brand new vlog. Bye.